came down here today just to thank each and every one of you, just like Floyd has done for your tremendous inspiration. I don't think you realize down here in Birmingham what you mean to us up there in New York. And I don't think that white Americans understand what Birmingham means to all of us throughout this country. And we think about the little kids being tossed from one side of the street to the other by the tremendous force of this hose. And we think about, uh, this picture just sickens me, this big brave policeman down here with his knee on the throat of this lady. And the problem of it is, ladies and gentlemen, is that this same picture of the dogs and of this policeman with his knee in the throat of this lady is a picture that's being portrayed throughout the world. And I think the conscience of America is beginning to awaken. I think the first steps that were made here by the Birmingham businessmen with Dr. King and the other leaders down here is an indication that perhaps the conscience of Birmingham is beginning to awaken. The only thing that we are demanding is that we be allowed to move ahead just like any other American citizen. Yeah. 